His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa hosted a Ramadan Majlis leaders at an iftar banquet at Rafah Palace. His Royal Highness highlighted the importance of Team Bahrain's unified efforts to meet the kingdom's wide-ranging development goals led by His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. His Royal Highness affirmed that Bahraini citizens are essential partners in realizing the kingdom's development goals and aspirations and remain at the core of the kingdom's advancement. His Royal Highness expressed pride in the efforts and contributions of Bahraini citizens in their various workplaces, noting the kingdom's commitment to continue upscaling the national workforce. He praised the positive impact Bahrainis have had on several projects and government programs, which is appreciated by all. His Royal Highness exchanged greetings with the Majlis leaders on the occasion of the holy month of Ramadan, expressing his best wishes for continued progress and prosperity for the kingdom and its people under the leadership of His Majesty the King. His Royal Highness noted that such gatherings provide a platform to provide strong bonds among citizens and strengthen social connections in the kingdom's society. His Royal Highness noted the kingdom's unique society, a multicultural haven whose people share the same national identity, noting that the safety and security enjoyed by the kingdom under the leadership of His Majesty the King are an important feature of Bahrain. He emphasized the national responsibility to safeguard and maintain the kingdom's safety and security. His Royal Highness expressed pride in the successes of the Kingdom's Economic Recovery Plan and Bahrain Economic Vision 2030, affirming the importance of measuring and evaluating the remaining goals and achieving them as part of the ongoing development efforts. His Royal Highness expressed his anticipation and optimism for Bahrain Economic Vision 2050, for which His Royal Highness has directed to begin consultations aimed at furthering the Kingdom's development to benefit all. He underscored the importance of unifying efforts to meet current and future development goals to benefit all. He expressed pride in the achievements of Bahraini youth across the various fields, noting that each achievement serves as a cause for celebration as the Kingdom continues to achieve successes and goals to foster a brighter future for all. His Royal Highness emphasized his commitment to strengthen partnership with the private sector through initiatives that create promising opportunities for Bahraini citizens adding that the efforts are ongoing to empower Bahrainis to ensure they remain the first choice in the labor market. He underscored Bahrain's firm stance towards the Palestinian cause and its unwavering commitment to reaching a peaceful, lasting and fair solution in support of Palestinians' legitimate right to establish an independent state with East Jerusalem as its capital. For their part, the attendees expressed gratitude to His Royal Highness for his unwavering dedication to all the members of society and for strengthening the social fabric of Bahrain, wishing the kingdom further progress and prosperity under the leadership of His Majesty the King. The Chairman of the Board of Trustees of the Isa bin Salman Educational Charitable Trust and Chairman of the Board of Directors of the Labour Fund Tamkeen, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, along with other senior officials, were also in attendance. On the occasion of Arab Orphan Day, which is celebrated on the first Friday of April, the representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, expressed thanks and appreciation to His Majesty the King, the Honorary President of the Royal Humanitarian Foundation, for his fatherly care towards the orphans in Bahrain. 
hailing His Majesty's keenness on providing a stable life for everyone. His Highness also commended the support the RHF receives from the government led by His Royal Highness the Crown Prince and Prime Minister as it gives considerable attention to the RHF's efforts towards orphans and all ministries endeavor to facilitate services to develop the foundation's work. For his part, the Secretary General of the Royal Humanitarian Foundation, Sheikh Ali bin Khalifa Al Khalifa, affirmed that the foundation has been keen on providing all forms of care to orphans and on training them on many skills to support them in launching projects that enable them to increase their income. He added that the foundation is implementing community partnership with many entities to provide further services and endeavors to achieve an investment financial infrastructure that ensures its continuity to provide support to all those in need in Bahrain and in brotherly and friendly countries. Speaker of the Council of Representatives, Mr. Ahmed bin Salman al Salam emphasizes that the Kingdom of Bahrain, under the leadership of His Majesty the King, attaches great importance to enhancing the culture of peaceful coexistence, establishing principles of human brotherhood, and supporting the unification of international efforts to uphold the values of human conscience. Marking the International Day of Conscience observed on the 5th of April each year, al Salam commended the humanitarian initiative adopted by the United Nations within the framework of Bahrain's global civilizational initiatives, which provides an opportunity to enhance the methodology of cooperation, solidarity, and humanitarian unity in addressing all the challenges, eliminating wars, confronting terrorism, and rejecting hatred and extremism. Alim Salam pointed out that the celebration of the International Day of Conscience is a fundamental pillar for establishing global security and peace, supporting sustainable development goals, and promoting the human rights system for a safe and stable world, as well as peaceful solutions to conflicts and disputes. On the occasion of the International Day of Conscience, the Chairman of the Shura Council, Mr. Ali bin Saleh al Saleh, underlined Bahrain's pioneering role in promoting the values and principles of coexistence and a culture of peace among countries and peoples of the world which is a result of the comprehensive development project and the noble initiatives of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. Mr. al expressed pride in Bahrain's rich and illustrious journey under the leadership of His Majesty the King, with a remarkable record of achievements and successes based on humanitarian principles and authentic deeply rooted values. He highlighted that the International Day of Conscience is a Bahraini and humanitarian message to the world for peace and prosperity, and a high international appreciation of the Kingdom of Bahrain. He pointed out to the efforts of the government under the leadership of His Royal Highness, the Crown Prince and Prime Minister, in supporting endeavors to promote peace and humanitarian values, and enhancing sustainable development based on security, stability, and the respect for human rights. Countries around the world also celebrate the International Day of Conscience on April the 5th every year, which was adopted by the United Nations in 2019 in response to Bahrain's initiatives. More details in this report. Following Bahrain's initiative to designate an International Day of Conscience, which was adopted by the United Nations in 2019, and in a bid to recognize the importance of global collaboration for peace, tolerance, and the rejection of violence and hatred, the world celebrates the International Day of Conscience on April 5th of each year. The International Day of Conscience serves as a reminder that the current global challenges and risks compel the world to prioritize human conscience in putting an end to wars, conflicts and their causes. It urges the allocation of resources and wealth towards sustainable development, addressing issues of poverty, hunger and pandemics, especially in less developed countries. The day also seeks to promote values of tolerance, brotherhood, justice and coexistence between religions, cultures and civilizations. And under the wise guidance of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, the Kingdom of Bahrain has emerged as a beacon of peaceful coexistence, security and harmony, with policies and relationships founded on the principles of balance and moderation, and exceptional initiatives aimed at promoting global peace and nurturing a spirit of coexistence among peoples and communities.